Good afternoon. Derek Tant here. We're in the dining room kitchen area of Mikasa. Uh, worked last night. I gotta work tonight. But if you recall, last week I placed an order to Boswell's Tobacco out in Chambersburg, Pennsylvania. So I you know, went to sleep this morning, woke up this afternoon. Some told me to check the front door and we've got a package. So I haven't made an order for like multiple tins of tobacco in a very long time. I remember, and I know we've all done this. I remember I'd sit at the computer with the browser open for hours, checking tobacco reviews.com thinking, all right, we got to get, we got to hit $95 for that free shipping. What are we going to get? And just agonizing over, <laughs> agonizing over your order until you're like, that's it. And then waiting with sweet anticipation for the box to come in. Well, it's here. And I've, I haven't really ordered a, a, made a big order like this in a really long time. It might have, it might be two years. Um, I've made, I've made small orders, like one, one, pe one bit of tobacco at a time. Like whenever you say, hey, notify me when this is back in stock. And I've ordered from that. From like a big order like this, I haven't done it in a while. All right. Invoice. I'm not going to read off the invoice. That's half the fun of the yabbo. All right. We got the... We got the these are the these are the new air pillows. Man, they are not they don't pop easily. They do not. Not like my dogs are like. <laughs> yeah. By the way, this is like the second video today. If I want to check out that other one, I, we did a we did like a pumpkin at work. <laughs> Made it look like Pennywise the Clown. All right. Okay. So here we go. Here we go. Here we go. First thing, I got some Gallus and Hogarth's Black Sliced Twist. This is another one of their, uh, this is like some of their, their, their rope stuff. I got a couple of those. But man, I, I, I've, you can see it's like, it's like pre-cut rope tobacco. Ooh. It smells just it smells just like uh, Sam Gowith's Black 20. Okay, ooh, here we go. Can't order from Bo uh, from Boswell's and not get a tin of Northwoods. And this is like a full 2 ounce tin. Not that one and a half ounce BS. This is a full two ounce tin. And look at that. And it's nice and sealed up. Yeah. I'm, uh, I haven't had Boswell's Northwoods in a while. Let's see. What else? Boswell's No Bite Delight. Also in a two ounce tin. I've had some Boswell's aromatics in the past. I mean, it's been a good while. And, you know, I'd like to think I've evolved. And I'm going to give aromatics a, no, a new shot. So, everything else that I'm going to be showing should be aromatics. This is the big aromatic order. All right. Next one. Boswell's Best. Two ounce tin. Um, I think the last time I smoked a Boswell aromatic, it was Boswell's Cupcake. And I didn't like it. And it was probably for the same reasons that I haven't liked a lot of other aromatics. I thought the taste was fine, but it just left me wanting. So we're going to be correcting that. All right. Next tobacco. All right. This is Dan Tobacco's Blue Note. I, ha I I bought a tin of this, I'm sure it was nine or ten years ago. Um, and I liked the taste, but again, I had a hard time, I had a hard time smoking it. 
uh, and enjoying it properly. Okay, here we go. This one is legendary. Um, I've been hearing about this one for a very, very long time. I've never had it. It's been recommended to me many times. This is kind of like one of these original crossover blends that people like used to go nuts for. This was huge 10 years ago. They still make it. I think it's like made with a lot of Kia, but here we go. Silum's Black, and you can't beat that tin art. I mean, that is, that is gorgeous. That thing looks phenomenal. This is a German-made pipe tobacco. The Germans, you know, they do the they do the, the aromatics pretty good. So I think this is an aromatic blend that has been blended with some lot of Kia. So maybe it's in the same vein as Frogmorton Cellar. All right, and finally the Peace de Resistance. This is one that they're saying. You can't get it in America. Like, it's hard to find. Uh, it's actually has been known by another name. But we're going to go with Rattray's. It says Exotic Passion. But this is the Exotic Orange. An orange, like a freshly, a fresh orange tasting tobacco. I've heard that this is like the best aromatic tobacco ever made. I've, I've heard from a lot of people that this is the best stuff and that, <clears throat> you know, and they, they were not sending it to America. So we found it. I got it. And <laughs> there's probably more of it at Boswell's Tobacco. So maybe go over there and, you know, Fine, you know, raid their raid their stores. They got a lot of good stuff. Silum's black for years. You can't find this stuff. Blue Note, you can't find it. You know, it, it's hard to find. It sells out. It's it's like one of these sellout. You, know, you don't even hear about them anymore because the people who know are always getting them. So get them. And of course, we got and Boswell's. It's the only place you can get Boswell tobacco. Boswell Northwoods, basically. One of the the big the big replacements for the Frog Morton series. It's a really nice English blend. So that's it. I gotta clean up this mess. I gotta get some coffee. I gotta go to work. But I just thought I would share the the order. This doesn't look like a lot, but it is. It looks it's. I mean, look at these huge. Look at these huge tins. So <coughs> in the coming. Uh, Weeks, months, we're going to be cracking into these, and we're going to be sampling them. And the good thing about aromatic tobaccos, they keep in their own tins. You can keep, They don't dry out. So, I'm excited. So, this week, we're going to be at least, I'm going to be cracking into one or some of these. Um, it's like it's a delight to the senses. All right. So, yeah. Thanks for watching. Um... I've got a new video out on Briar Report TV. Uh, I think you'd like it. It's kind of a kind of shows off more of what I got from the the Texas Pipe Show and maybe some clips from a concert that I went to. So be sure to go over to briarreport.org, click on BR TV, and check it out. In the meantime, thanks for watching. I appreciate you all. God bless and smell my beard. <laughs>